king. Ba ba ba. It says it's starting soon. Is it working? If anybody's watching, please let me know if it's working. I don't know. It's working. I've gotten a good I've gotten a good to go. So I'm gonna open a live chat in a new window. Um, if anybody's here watching, then just say hi and let me know. Oh, it's working. Yay. Okay. Hi guys. How's it going? I'm on. I don't know because oh hey, hi, how's it going? Um welcome to my live stream to celebrate Ian's song music video. My very first music video ever, official music video. Um, so, I guess first off, I wanna I wanna tell you um, a little bit about Ian's song and and why why I wrote it, how I wrote it, and um, why we did a music video. First off, I met this guy, and about two months into dating, I ended up booking a role on SVU, Law and Order SVU, and I had to go away to New York for a couple weeks. And while I was gone, I kind of realized that I was falling madly, madly, madly in love with this dude. And, um, and, uh, and so I decided that I wanted to start, I wanted to write a song for him and kind of profess my love to him. And when I got back, I would, I would play it for him and we would fall madly in love and, and be together forever. So, Meet. I'm gonna pull Ian over here. Meet. What's this up, is guys? Ian of Ian's Song slash director of the music video. If you saw it, I'm watching your guys' comments right now. Slash Let coordinator of this video. Is it still repeating? I I was looking in the other room and seeing that. We just want to make sure it's working. Yeah. This is still. So I think this is the first time we've done this. So we have to kind of like, I'm the tech guy here today as well. So. So let us know. It's going to take like 15 minutes for you guys. Hi, Ian. Hey. So, so is it working? We're also on a delay, so we could There's be a just going delay. around in a circle for like an hour. So we'll just we'll just hang out for a little bit. And, and, see, and uh, make sure that things are good. Tell us if it's, you know, if we're still... I don't know. Hi, Ian. Hi, Ian. Hey. So we know that he's... he's so um, while we're checking to make sure everything's solid... Um, we want to tell you it's okay. working great. Right. Oh yeah. There you go. Awesome. Thanks so much for, for for tuning in. If you have any questions, we're going to be answering questions throughout the chat. Also, if you're on Twitter and you don't have a YouTube that you can log into and chat with us, then you can just do hashtag Ask Skylar Day, which I'll be checking on this thing. All right. Throughout the thingy. Um, so we want to tell you why 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 did we choose this song to do a music video for? Well, I think this song was one that Skylar wrote a really long time ago, and as soon as she played it, I mean, it was obviously it meant a lot uh, to me, but I could see it. I think it was the one song that that she played that there was a really clear story. So I don't want to say it was the easiest to do a music video for, but it was straightforward. I could see it we in my head. To, to sort of give you an image of what it was like to write the song, but then those flashes of us together was what I was thinking about while I was writing it, so. Which is pretty cool. The, the process was really collaborative. Yeah. I mean, it fine. says I'm the director, but Skylar really helped direct this thing, so. You know. It was very cool. I'm a control freak. She is kind of a control freak. <laughs> um, I remember watching you when I was younger and having you inspire me so much. You're so amazing and incredibly talented. Thank you, Ashley. Ashley, I feel like I know you because we've been talking over social media forever. So, hi, Ashley. Glad you're tuning in. Um, and thank you, Elizabeth. I'm glad you like our decision to do this song. So, um, if you have, what is on the necklace you always wear, Skylar? This one? What's up, Chris? Thank you, I really appreciate that. Coming from you, that means a lot. <laughs> um, the <laughs> necklace that I always wear, it's probably, it's not this one, it'll probably be another one. It's a necklace that Ian got me. Not this one, but the, the, I actually almost wore it. 
What is, what's it I was called? like, I don't remember giving that to you. No, what's the... But in the, moments like that, you just say... Not the yeah. green one, but the... the What's the gold one with the little... Thing? Druzy? Is, is that a druzy? what it's called? I don't know. He's it's just a, it's probably a druzy. Up. He doesn't know. Um, but the smaller one. The smaller one. Green Garnet. Green, green Garnet. Green Garnet. Green Garnet. Um, well, guys, I think... Uh, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna play you Ian's song. Should we get this thing going? Just do it, and and let me know if the sound is is off or anything, and we'll try and fix it. Um, All right, I'm gonna get out of here. Bye, let's guys. Just, let's just. He'll be back. He'll be back. He's making sure everything's everything's good. So I'm gonna I'm gonna play you Ian's song. Past three, can't get to sleep. Feeling kind of lonely in these hotel sheets. It's getting worse. This aching in my chest, giving me hell ever since I left. And my heart breaks when you're not around. No, it don't make much sense. This feeling I found only know you. Somehow it feels like a thousand years we've been apart Now I'm calling you up Every chance I get And sometimes I wonder if you're sick of me yet And would you think it's strange If you knew every night I slept in a t-shirt I stole from your room Cause it smells like you And my heart breaks away That was Ian's song. I think I may have changed the lyrics, which is funny because I've played the song three thousand times. Um, so while we're um, oh, thank you, Skylar Daydreamy. Um, while we're on this song, I figure I should I should play you a new one that is the next chapter to that story, which. Um, Babe, do you want to get in here for this one? He's not coming. I'll just be sitting here. So, while we're uh, while we're on that story, I figure I should play this next one. It's called Mine Sweet Mine. And we went to Italy over Thanksgiving this past year. And while we were there, we may or may not have gotten engaged. And... We, it, it all, it all went down in this little town called Cortona, which is a little medieval town in Tuscany on top of a hill surrounded by a big stone wall, and it's beautiful and amazing. And there you are. It's on a delay. He's watching in the other room, and so, like, <laughs> I'll ask him to come in, and he won't know for, like, 30 seconds that I'm actually talking to him. That's great. But, um, so, so, yeah, we got, we got engaged. We got engaged. In she said yes. Italy. I said yes. I also made him do it twice. It's a very important part. I said yes twice. She said yes twice. I made him do it twice because I forgot. Or I not forgot. I literally went blank. <laughs> and then was just like beside myself and did not, 
couldn't remember, even though it happened right then. I was like, I don't know. Do it again. Please do it one more time. And so then I remembered, obviously. Thank you, Elizabeth. Thank you so much. Um, So. Thank you, Brian. I, yeah. I, um, after that, after it all went down, we went back to where we were staying, and I was sitting there, and and then I had the thought, I need to write a song about this, but I didn't have my guitar with me because we were, we were, um, out of town, and it's too hard to travel overseas with this. She gets very airplane. worked up when that thing has to fly. Airplane. Gosh, if you are a guitarist, raise your hand. I can't see it, but I'm going to imagine. We have it's a whole thing we do when we bring guitars. the guitar on the plane. We have to hide, and I have to, like... Because people don't like you bringing guitars on planes for whatever Nobody reason. Nobody likes it. It's very annoying. But um, story is, I didn't have my guitars, so I sat down and I wrote in my notebook all of these thoughts and, and ideas about what it what just happened and and um and then when we got back i uh i wrote this one which you haven't heard before i remember going to bed that night and you were filling up your journal mm-hmm. with just words and words and words and i was too tired to stay awake so i just that's right so here i go again okay bye. you can have to say it louder bye. next time so i can hear you i thought i screamed it but yeah, i well maybe so i'm just checking checking the chat oh i feel like i should check twitter since i said that i would Oh, ah. Okay. Ah. Apparently I don't know how to work my phone. There it goes. All right. So this, guys, is uh, called Mine Sweet Mine. Actually, isn't mine, sweet mine. I was playing a different song. My head was in somewhere other place. This is mine, sweet mine. Just like a dream, this little town on top of a hill under Tuscan clouds. Stone streets, pale yellow moon, smiling me, shining for you. The last strip of sunset, getting smaller by the second. We chased her for as long as we could, then we stopped. We stare just as she disappears I fall deeper in love like you should Sweet, sweet love Oh, you're down on your knee now Asking questions about forever Nothing in this world has ever been so right and for me to be yours and you to be mine, sweet mine. First time we met, I remember so clear the shirt that you wore. Style of your hair, how you waited outside to ask if you could call me sometime, and I prayed you would. And those next nights were restless, and my days were no exception as I retrace your face in my head. She knew that no one else would do. It turns out she's always right in the end. Sweet, sweet love, oh, you're down on your knee now, asking questions about forever. In this world, 
has ever been so right for me to be yours and you to be mine sweet mine I'm done I'm through I'll never wonder about another Nothing in this world has ever been so right for me to be yours and you to be mine, sweet mine. So that is our engagement song. <laughs> um, oh wait, I just saw that my grandmommy is watching. Hi, grandmommy. She's in Georgia right now. Um, and my Aunt Diane. And my mom. It's a family reunion. Um, so, ho, ho, trying to think. Um, if you guys have any questions, just shoot them my way, and we'll answer them as we go. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep playing songs for you. Which I guess is fine, too. So, I, um... I've been writing since I was 10. I wrote my first song. It was called Granddaddy's Love. And my grandma still requests it to this day. Um, and I, uh, I, I found that over, over all these years that I haven't really nailed down a method for, for writing and how I write a song. Sometimes it just comes right out and other times it takes absolutely forever. It's always changing. But this song in particular. Um, hi, Ansley. My cousin Ansley is watching, too, in Georgia. Um, oh, and Jackson. My godson, Jackson, is watching also. This is so exciting. Hi, Lisa. Um, <laughs> uh, what, I, the, what song was I playing? Oh, I was going to tell you about this song, which is on my YouTube channel. It's called Los Angeles, and I, I started writing this six years ago. And I, I kept putting it down and, and being like, mm, I don't know, I, it's not really, I don't know about it. it. I wasn't sure. And then I kept picking it back up and, and writing a little more and then putting it back down. And it just basically haunted me for, for six years. And then I finally was like, okay, song, I'm going to finish you. We're going to do this. We're going to be best friends. And this, my friends, is called... Los Angeles. Wake up in the morning, freezing cold. Pull the blanket to my chin and leaves on my toes. Gotta get myself out of this bed and make the best of the bad day I haven't had yet. This place, the sky was always too blue for your taste. But watch you have to go and steal the sun. You had to know I need it when you turned to run. Oh, you made it look so easy. Like you couldn't wait to leave. In the land of the sun, and it's supposed to shine. But ever since you took a step across that sea line. Send me back to the ice age. Think you said he Talking about the pain just like it was forced on you So I would pick you apart Petals on a flower loves me, loves me not Cause you made it look so easy Like you couldn't wait to leave In the land of the sun is supposed to shine But ever since you took a step 
across that state line Deep dark way, all I ever see is rain Leave it to you, you sent me back to the ice age Think you're setting a record Oh, since you left it's never been colder Los Angeles In the land of the sun, it's supposed to shine But ever since I took a step across that state line Deep dark way, all I ever see is rain Leave it to you, send me back to the ice age Think you're setting a record Oh, since you left It's never been colder in Los Angeles In Los Angeles So that is the six year song. I'm gonna check your stuff. Oh, I have a question. Um, not music related entirely, this is from Elizabeth. But how was it being on Pretty Little Liars? It's actually how I found out about your music, actually through being a fan of that. Oh, that's, that's awesome. That's so exciting that it, um, I like when, when the acting world and the music world meet and kind of help each other, um, and, uh, but Pretty Little Liars was awesome, and it, it was so cool that they, they brought me back for a, a second episode, um, because the, the show was huge, and so that was, that was very exciting to, um, to get on. Everybody that I know freaked out, so it, I loved being on it, um, so yeah, it was great. It was great, Elizabeth. Um, do you have a CD coming out soon? I'm actually working, I'm getting in the studio again soon. Uh, I do not have a specific time that it's coming out, but um, new music will be coming out at some point, soon, hopefully. Keep checking in. Grandmommy loves that song. Thanks, Grandmommy. Parenthood fans, yay for Parenthood. Aren't we so sad that it's over? I'm sad. I'm very sad. I wish I if if I could make that show go on forever and just become an old decrepit person doing that show, I would. I definitely would. Um I sent you a box to the Yes, I did get it. I did get it. Thank you. Thank you very, very, very much. Loved the EP. Full album next. We shall see. I'm gonna keep it mysterious. Because I'm, I'm going in for writing sessions this week, and you never know. Could turn into an EP, could turn into a full album. Maybe it'll be a 30-song album. Just kidding. Maybe not. Hey, Brian, thanks. I'm glad you love Parenthood. Um, well, guys, let me check Twitter real quick, and then uh, my phone's not reloading. My phone's like, no. But, uh, and let me know if the, again, if the sound is all dandy. 30 songs. Maybe. Okay. So, I figure I should, I should take us back to the, uh, the EP. Um, this song was... This song was uh, the first song that I chose to put on the EP and ended up actually being literally the first song um, on the album. And, uh, and yeah, so it's, um, this is called Circles. If you know it, sing along. Empty rooms, cardboard box 
reading like chats between my aunts and my mom oh I think that's it as far as family goes um so that circles um well guys if it's okay with you I, I had a couple people request Riptide by Vance Joy because I did a, a cover of that on on my YouTube channel and um, I love that song. It's the best. And I love Vance Joy. I actually got to see him um, last year, I think. And he's amazing. Although I missed like most of it. He was opening for Taylor Swift and I came in very, very late. And I missed. I got to hear that song though, which was great. So, Riptide. Let's do this, unless you guys have a question. Ba -ba. Lots of emojis. Thanks for the emojis. I love emojis. I want to know your favorite emoji. Put it up there while I sing this song. I'm trying to think how it starts. I think that's it. I was scared of dentists in the dark. And starting conversations Oh, my friends are turning green You're the magician's assistant in their dreams Ooh, ooh When they come and stop Lady running down to the I'm 
from himself She's been living on the highest shelf joy you're a cool dude great the poop emoji somebody likes the poop emoji that's oh wait that's my mom okay <laughs> uh -huh. my mom has the pillow of the poop emoji i'm sure you can get it at like target or someplace if you want it um so guys oh one thing that i did want to tell you which is pretty exciting and not music related at all, but, um, I am, I am in a show that's coming out in November, November 15th, on MTV, I think at 10, we will be premiering, and it's called Sweet Vicious, and I'm very, very excited about it, I'm so happy to be a part of this show, and I think, I think you're gonna love it, and I, and I hope you watch, and so mark your calendars, November, November 15th, Sweet Vicious, MTV, November 15th. So, that's very exciting. I'm very, very, very thrilled. Greetings from, from Greece. What? That's cool. Hello, Leader Kappa. From, what kind of guitar is that? This is a Taylor, um, um, a GS Mini with Koa wood. It's beautiful. I got it. When did I get this? Like six months ago? About six months ago. And I'm in love with it. And it's about, it's like more my size. I'm like a mini person. So it's more mini. It's a GS mini, but it's mini like me. It's like a little Polly Pocket guitar. So, um, I have notes here. Which I'm, I'm, which I'm peeking at. Oh, I want to play you guys a song, which is also on my, it's on my YouTube, but it's, it's kind of fun to play, and, um, it's called Human, and I, uh, I wrote this song about, I started writing it right after a very frustrating encounter slash conversation with someone, and came home, kind of let it out on the guitar and started writing this one and and kept going back to it after similar frustrating encounters and and it's kind of become this little anthem for me about being just human and, and realizing that we all have our differences and we should accept them and embrace them and um, we're all just stronger that way and that's uh that's what this song's for. Well, you got an opinion about everything, always ready with a fistful of darts. Flipping through me like a magazine to pick out the weakest parts.
knows me Tell me how is the weather up there, is it as cold as I think Oh, I better know why you won't come down Are you scared? I'll see it's just a paper crown But hey, we all do dress up till we find ourselves But hey, hey, I'm human too I got a heartbeat in my chest just like you If you show me yours, that is human. Because we're all just human, guys. Do you have plans to do any shows? Any shows being live concert shows or shows being TV shows? Let me know, Elizabeth. Because. Well, I guess I should, I, I'll just answer. As far as the TV shows go, I have a show coming out called Con Man. Um, or I'm, I'm in a, a few episodes. I actually don't know the count of episodes. But, um, and then Sweet Vicious. And then as far as live shows goes, I am, I don't have any set up right now, except for this one, which we're at right now. We're just hanging. But that's it. And I will be sure to tweet, Instagram, Facebook, uh, I think that's it. All the social media and YouTube. But I will, I will let you know about future events. Also, you can sign up for my mailing list, which is on SkylarDay.com. You can go find that. Sign up, and I'll let you know about news. Um, congratulations on the new music video. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Meg. And on the engagement, thank you very much. How many guitars do you own? I own three. Three guitars. Three guitars. How tall are you? I'm, I am five foot and a quarter, but I like to round up to five one because it makes me feel special. But I'm a mini, mini. Do you have any plans? Do you still watch The Walking Dead? I'm way behind. I'm way, be like I'm, I don't know who's alive anymore. My mom watches it like nobody's business, but I'm, I'm very, very behind. Although Ian's more behind than I am, because he's never watched it. <laughs> How many episodes have you seen? Like two? i seen like a half an episode. He's just way behind. I've seen a lot of killing happen. Oh, yeah. Lots of, lots of zombie killings. Love you both. Can't wait to see you soon. Hi, Carrie. I love you. Um, well, guys, I, uh, just for funsies, let me pull this up, uh, I had a lot of, I've had a lot of requests to do, oh, no, I hope people aren't asking questions on Twitter, because it's not reloading. Well, we're here. It's you and I. That's fine. Um, I had a lot of requests to do an old song fireflies and I figure I would give it a go it's been so long can I play any other instruments unfortunately no no I I uh I did play piano when I was little but then I and then I kind of fell out of it um and then picked up guitar um 
any more collaborations between you and Ian in the works, you know, beyond the music video? Just marriage. <laughs> as, as, uh, as far as I, as, yeah, as of right now, just, just the old marriage stuff. Um, but Fireflies... Sorry, it's probably really weird for you guys to watch this and see me just completely blank out because I'm reading. But I, I figure I'd play it for you guys since I've had a bunch of requests for a while. Um, not just for this, but... Um, and I'm pulling up the lyrics right now because it's been a minute. What? I wrote this song when I was... 14 or 15. It may, it may very well be the first song uh, that I that I finished on guitar. I know I started a bunch of other ones, but it may very well be the the only song that uh, or the the first song that that I actually finished. And I and I wrote this one because I was obsessed with country music. I still am, um, but I I had this idea that I wanted to I wanted to write a song that was that was my dream like whirlwind romance and like country style <laughs> like you know we're out in the backyard and fireflies and although although Ryan was a guy that I had a crush on when I was like in first grade so I, that's 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 true and I did catch fireflies when I was younger in pickle jars and running around in the backyard. I'm reading the lyrics right now. With dirty knees and bare feet. Um, and I did live in Georgia. I'm from Georgia. Walmart gumball machine. Used to go to Walmart, Walmart all the time. Plastic rings. So, let's give this a go. Bear with me. It's gonna be good times. Um, <laughs> You remember this. In the summer of 99, Ryan caught my eye. No longer just the boy next door to me. Fireflies and pickle jars would run around in his backyard. Dirty knees and bare feet. He took my head, he took my heart. Stars when he smiled at me, and he got down on one knee, pulled out a plastic ring from the Walmart gumball machine. He said, If my mom says it's okay, would you marry me someday? Oh, oh pretty, please. Well, the only ones who heard my answer that night were the fireflies. You guys were doing it. At the lake when it got dark, he put his daddy's truck in.
guys we did it it's been a while that's been a long time since I played that tune but I'm, I'm glad whoever requested it requested it take us back in time um perfect wedding song <sighs> you know right Ansley singing along with you love it Ansley Doing a wonderful to keep working on reason to So um I would like to play you a song called uh Everybody. And I wrote this song because I was finding that there were when you find something really good in the love department and you have it and it's great there are a lot of people that want to tell you why it's too good to be true and why it's not gonna last and the amazing thing about that is we don't have to listen to them so this is called everybody We dove head first the water just like ice mm -hmm. But hands in hands, you know, it felt just right oh, oh, the moonlight on your skin Let's try that again, because this is the first time you guys are hearing this song, so I don't want to mess it up. So let's start over. the water just like ice mm -hmm. but hand in hand you know it felt just right oh, oh the moonlight on your skin the way that we stopped time oh so right then this is for life but everybody is telling us love like that don't exist but what do they Everybody 
can tell us that love like that don't exist They just don't know We're standing right in the middle of it And they say things change They say we'll grow They say it'll fade I say they don't know We're not like everybody Oh, oh we're not like everybody You're not like everybody, can I get an amen? Whoa! Dum, dum, dum. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Do you, Skylar, do you? Skylar, any chance you know Joshua Reed? I do his music. I mean, I don't know him personally. Was that the question? Um, I, I, do not know him personally, but I do know his music and love his music. So I'd be down to be in that friend group. <laughs> um, so uh, before I finish up here, I want um, to thank everybody that were, and tell you who worked on the video um, for Ian's song. Obviously. Do you want to come over here again? I'm just hanging. It's very strange to sit here and talk to a computer, talk to a green light. Granted, we're like chatting. It is a little strange. It's easier to sit on the floor right next to the He's computer. He's just sitting there and I can just see him. But um, this dude right here, the director, and um, and we had our, our guy, uh, Patrick Stringer, was our DP. Patrick's probably surfing right now or something yeah. in the ocean. Yeah. That's where he spends and, most um, of his time. And then Brian Legoo did our color. Brian Legoo. Legoo. Um, Making tweaks last night. Ben Silverman. and Ben and Silverman. Thank you for helping us. And, um, and my brother, Dalton, for being Dalton. our pack mule when we were running around like a bunch of crazy people. He was, he was our guy. That's right. And, uh, yeah. So, you guys, I think, uh, oh, I'm going to answer a couple more questions. Okay, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Where? I feel like I just saw a question about what are your favorite songs of the moment? Oh. You know who I'm obsessed with right now is Kelsey Ballerini. I think she is freaking fantastic. I love that girl. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm that's okay. She's talking about. <laughs> that's okay. Um, she's absolutely incredible. I think she's just brilliant, but, her, um, her whole album is beautiful, but the Peter Pan song was so good. Um, another one, um, I always loved Liz Longley. She's a songwriter who's kind of somehow flown under the radar, but she was an incredible songwriter, so look her up, Liz Longley. And also, Ingrid Michaelson. Um, I've been upset, I've been going through all of her... Um, old albums and her new one which I think is called uh, It Doesn't Have to Make Sense and there's a song on there which I'm blanking on the name of it's called A Whole Lot of Heart I think I think I Instagrammed about it the other day and I've already forgotten what the name of I think it's called A Whole A Whole A Whole Lot of Heart do once again I don't know <laughs> A Whole Lot of Heart do you know Robbie Williams no Robbie Williams but hi who's that to Robbie I don't know, Robbie. I love Ingrid, too. Leader Kappa. Oh, Ling Ingrid is so good. She's so good. Also, Sarah Bareilles. I can't get enough of that girl. And, like, good ops on her for freaking writing a musical. Robbie, Skyler listens it. to a lot of country. I do. Well, Sarah Bareilles isn't country. Is she, is she country? I don't know all these things, but this I know when I get in her Jane. car, it's always on country. It's country country music because I grew up in Georgia so I listen to country music also I Nothing love songwriting country. and country music but um yeah it's always country I'm trying to think of another song Girl Crush by um <laughs> I'm blanking why am I I'm blanking on everybody's names right now um so you guys know what I'm talking about um Little Big Town there we go British pop star oh no I do not know Robbie Williams but I'll have to look him I'll up I'll have to check him out hell yeah um Thank you for the concert. You did a wonderful job. Thank you, Brian. I unfortunately had to miss the first half of the stream. 
moderating this live stream is, so it may have been already played, but if you can, if not, can I request a yellow t-shirt? You know what? What the hell? Let's try and play. I haven't played it in a while, so this could be interesting. <laughs> this but, is a um, big deal. She wasn't going to do that. Do you want to sit and bop to the song while I play it? Do you want me to? I don't know. Is that kind of weird? Well, okay, I'll tell you a story, a little little story. Ooh, are you a, fun, a fan of um, Hunter Hayes then? Yes, I am a fan. He's, he doesn't, he, he plays like every instrument imaginable, which blows my mind. What's Little Big Town, Anastasia? Little Big Town, Little Big Town is the band that wrote, or that performs Girl Crush. Oh, yes, Little Big Town. Ben must know that one he too. He doesn't. He doesn't know. He just doesn't know. <laughs> <sighs> he just doesn't know. Um, Cam. I'm just gonna say all the things Anastasia writes. Uh, oh, you guys, I'm, I'm trying to. Do you really want me to sit here for this? Do you remember? I'm trying to remember which capo it's on. <laughs> I would not know that. I feel like almost looking up the video that I posted forever ago. I can I tell think you it's... that's right if you start playing it. Wait, hold on. I'm, I'm genuinely going to, I'll know, I'll know, I'll This know. is what she does. She Hold goes on. on YouTube and she looks up her songs. Sometimes when I forget, when I forget, oh, oh There's on. nothing wrong with that. When I forget, I go on. There it is. Wait, I don't know if I should play it. I just turned the volume off. Oh, volume's off. Okay, you guys, I just want to make sure, ha, I was right, you guys. That's pretty fancy. It's okay. It's I'm just, fancy. here, oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. L-O-L. What if? What if I will be playing What If Last, which is next? But I'll I'll do um I'll do Yellow T-shirt now and then um and then and Anastasia then I'll play What is If. Anastasia is possibly Skylar's biggest fan. Anastasia and has been to all my shows as well as this man right here. But and Anastasia, I love you very much. She's, she's amazing. She's a badass. She she is. She's incredible. a badass, she's and she a knows huge support. All of my songs when I'm playing a concert. She is there mouthing the words to all of my songs. She knows lyrics I don't know at times, which is pretty awesome. Um, um, this is not different than you running lines. What about Ron yeah, Pope, Brett Denon? Cool. That's I right, love Diane. Both of those. I do know <gasps> Casey Musgraves. I love her. I'm going to see her soon, actually. Um, I'm obsessed with her Follow Your Arrow. She's, she's an amazing songwriter. You've heard pageant material. The whole album is brilliant, but the song. Put your phone away. Um, Thanks, late Chris. To the, late to the party. What? Oh, put your phone. Away. Yeah. Why were you looking at your phone? Chris texted me to put my phone away, which is kind of a funny thing. To do. <laughs> so let's do. Let's try this. He's gonna bop to the song. I'm gonna bop to the song. Oh gosh, I don't. Yeah. Don't oh wait, no. There we go, guys. Let's do this. Your records nailed to the wall And a boy with a yellow t-shirt on Staring back at me It's very distracting I'll, I'm sorry, I'll stop reading when you're playing Oh wait, you know what I can do? So that I won't actually Oh no, that's not true What? I can't do it, I can't do it I thought I had the lyrics Why are you stopping? Because do you know the words? We yeah. start again. I'll fill her in when she misses the words. Bunch of records nailed to the wall and a boy with a yellow t-shirt on staring back at me. Got his head on the arm of a leather couch, hand on my knees, eye on my mouth, watching me sing. I've been talking like we've been talking like we'll be together all the way to forever. Dreams. 
got a couple books on your coffee table about all the places you wanna go. Somehow we'll make it up. Huh? Somehow we'll make it. Oh, he doesn't know. <laughs> he doesn't know. He's all. Well, we can do this. Somehow we'll make it happen, honey. We're young and dumb and we got no money. And I've never felt so beautiful So don't you ever let me go Oh no Ooh, I'm gonna love you any way We wrote that song because I, I wrote one lyric what in this song was, so we wrote the what song what happened was on this couch we wrote it on it this was couch. actually yes it was on this couch this is the black leather couch this was the, about like what three months in dating we were like hanging out we were drinking drinking wine. some wine it was like two in the morning drinking wine and I was like oh, we need to write a song together and I was like, like that's not a good right idea right now right now and so I got I got my guitar and we sat there and I was like we should just write about everything that's happening right now, literally. So when it's, he was wearing a yellow t-shirt, leather couch, he was staring at me. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty matter of fact. There were some books, there were some travel there books was, on the coffee table. I mean, it was really. It was, uh, yeah, it was pretty straight to the point. Yeah. Um, it worked though. Um, uh, ooh, there's questions. This is not different than if you ever come in, come perform in Texas somewhere, I'll be there. Yay! Thank you. There you go. Um, this is one of the first songs of yours that I fell in love with, Skylar. Thank you for playing it. Thank you, Meg, for requesting it. Um, wake up to your handsome face. <laughs> I'm so glad that he's here because this is just a, such a bizarre. Also, Los Angeles. What? Um. Ba, ba, ba. Okay. Oh. Cool, you guys. Ba, ba. Oh, Grandmommy loves this one. Thank you, Grandmommy. My Grandmommy is a singer and a performer, and she is pretty amazing. Pretty darn cool. And so we sing whenever I go home for Christmas. We sit there at the piano and we sing Christmas songs together, and it's amazing. So you guys, I think um, we're coming to um, the end of our stream. This has been fantastic. Thank you so much for hanging. Thanks for coming. With us. Thanks for. Um, as in play Los Angeles. I did. You missed it. Anastasia. You missed it. How did you kidding. miss that? But you guys, my uh, the Ian song is on on my YouTube. So go check it out. Uh, send it to your friends, your family. Yes, yeah, send it around. And if, yeah, just <laughs> watch it. <laughs> watch it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. That's all. I That's all like you can really do with those. it. Yeah, you can. You can watch you can it. Listen to you it can, too, but you can listen to it. Um, we leave the live stream up after. I think so. I've never done this before, so uh, possibly. Since my parents are absent right now, I think we might. That's what I'm going to vote for. They're absent. They're not able to watch. My mom's at work. My dad's at the cabin. And he doesn't have Wi-Fi up at the cabin. <laughs> we'll see if he gets this far into yeah, it. We'll, we'll, see if, we'll, see. we'll see if he has a comment about that. Like, mm. So, I'm going to I'm gonna play the last one. I'm going to get out of here. Can you do the Christmas song now? No, I'm saving that for Christmas. But thanks for asking. All right. I will I will post the Christmas song that I that I wrote um before way before Christmas but um you can look forward to that. But, Let me get um, out of here guys. It's been a pleasure. So this song, this last one for you is um 
ba ba ba. This song is a song about taking chances. So I, I and um, living your life. Can you do another live stream sometime? Yeah, let's do it again. Let's do it again sometime. This has been fun hanging out. So this uh, it's called What If. so much for for um, tuning in to this live stream and watching Ian's song and a um, and and keep keep checking in for more videos and news about things uh, concerts live streams things like that and I will talk to you guys later thank you so so much um, I'm looking and checking out things. Congratulations on the new year. Yeah. Thank you so much for doing that. Thank you so much. All right, guys. I'm so glad we've had a good time. Ian's going to come over and wave one more time. He's just sitting right there on the floor. Um, okay. Bye, guys. Thank you.